Species counterpoint students. Here we have another student composing in species counterpoint one. It's their first attempt, and there's a few issues that we really need to look at uh, so we can learn from what, what's going on here. So we're in the key of A, and there is an issue that seems to be going on with the student counting correctly and arriving at the intervals that they should be using. Again, in species counterpoint one, you can only use the, a unison, a third, a fifth, a sixth, or an octave. The tenth is also an option. Notice how the seventh is not an option here, so that should have never been attempted. Um, but let's let's take a look at these thirds and sixths and, and, and see if they really are what they should be. Here's an opening. That third measure. A B nat um, sorry, a C sharp or an alto clef. A C sharp to an F sharp is that a third, students? No, it's a fourth, so careful. Careful that you're counting correctly. Here's another one. F sharp in the alto. G sharp. That's not a sixth, it's a second. This one. B, C sharp. It's not a sixth, it's a second. Ay, ay, ay. Careful with the way you count your intervals. The next one. D. It's a D. This is an A. D to A, three. Ugh, no. Careful, careful, careful. The next one, C sharp. B. Is it a sixth? Well, we can't go on any further. Really, please, be careful the way you count your, vent your intervals. Alto clef, the middle line is a C. All right, hopefully we progress from here. Talk soon.